Like and subscribe and click the bell icon to get new video updates. Super Rugby Pacific Highlanders captain Aaron Smith blasts officials after loss to Hurricanes Highlanders captain Aaron Smith made the explosive accusation that his struggling side was getting robbed all the time after a heartbreaking Super Rugby Pacific loss to the Hurricanes in Dunedin on Saturday. After trailing 14-6 at half-time, the Highlanders staged a spirited second-half comeback and looked to have won the game when young prop Saul Amahu barged over the try line in the final second of the game. However, referee Angus Maybe, making his Super Rugby debut, ruled on field no try, feeling that Mayu was just short, and that Mu Couldnt find any evidence to overturn the decision. Watch every game of the 2022 Super Rugby Pacific and Super W seasons, streaming ad-free, live and on demand only on Stan Sport. Sign up for your free seven-day trial. The decision prompted loud boos from the home crowd and the Hurricanes will feel they were slightly fortunate to get the 22-21 win at the end. It could have been a try at the end, maybe it was, maybe it wasnt, all Black Star Smith said. But we re getting robbed all the time. We had a red card, Josh Dixon, for contact to the head and one of our guys, Gareth Evans, blatantly gets a black eye and the touches and ref walk it off like it's nothing. Read more, ugly rugby tactic shunned by fun-loving Chiefs Read more, dejected red skipper makes blunt admission Read more, blues break 18-year drought in triumph over Crusaders All we want is consistency as players and we read just getting no rub of the green at the moment. It is hard to swallow. Dixon was sent off after 19 minutes after connecting with Hurricanes prop Tevita Mafaleo's head with his left shoulder. Maybe reached for the red card after viewing several replays as Mafaleo departed for an HIA. The incident looked clumsy rather than reckless, but the contact rocked Mafaleo's head backwards and players have been repeatedly told that head contact spells a yellow or red card. Dixon's red card capped a poor first quarter for the Highlanders, who also conceded two tries to Balin Sullivan and Sailsi Raorsi. That left the Hurricanes in control of the game, but they failed to kick on and the boot of Marty Banks kept the Highlanders in the game. Sean Maloney and Andrew Martins are joined by the host of Stan Sportis Clubland Andrew Swain. They talk Super Rugby Pacific, Club Rugby. Mystic Marts and the Weird Cat 15 the home side also got good value out of its bench, with Mitch Hunt and Folor Fakateva adding plenty of spark. Hurricanes replacement playmaker Aidan Morgan scored from a well-worked move to restore their advantage. It was enough to grab the four competition points, although not without the controversial finish. Hurricanes carve up Highlanders The Highlanders lost in form number 8 Marino Mikhail to you before kick-off with Hugh Renton taking his place. With Shannon Frizzell already out injured for two months, it was the last thing they needed, and Mikhail to US punch was missed on attack and in defence. The outlook worsened when new number 13 Denny Solomona left the field after just 16 minutes, after making an important tackle on Josh Murphy. The big moment maybe a decision to not award the try will prompt plenty of debate in Highlanders country, as will the black eye picked up by Evans after a ruck incident involving a Zafo Ormua. The Highlanders' back rower was clearly incensed by the incident, pointing to his shiner as he left the field, but it was cleared by the match officials. Match rating the 6th of May 10. The Highlanders' second half fireback provided plenty of drama, but both sides will feel the game was scrappy in patches. The big picture the Highlanders' finals hopes are far from over due to the eight-team finals format, but they will seek improvements as they head to Australia next week for the Super Round in Melbourne. Dixon's likely suspension adds to their challenges before meeting the Brumbies. The Hurricanes will meet the Reds, but they, too, will feel they need to go up a few gears. MVP Julian Saver and Sailsi Raorsi had some strong moments for the Hurricanes, while Gareth Evans was influential over the ball for the Highlanders. Scott Gregory showed his toughness in the second half, but Raorsi was probably the pick of the bunch. Hurricanes 22, Balin Sullivan try 7 minutes, Sailsi Raorsi 20 minutes try, Aidan Morgan try 74 minutes, Geordie Barrett 2 cons, Penn, 
Highlanders 21, Andrew McHaleo try 51 minutes, Max Hicks try 66 minutes, Marty Banks 3 pens, Con, HT, 14-6 for a daily dose of the best of the breaking news and exclusive content from Wide World of Sports. Subscribe to our newsletter by clicking here.